You're guaranteeing that this horse is going to win the Triple Crown. The Derby, the Preakness, and the Belmont. Three races, three states, in just five weeks. Hasn't been done in 25 years. That is exactly what I'm saying. An audacious statement at the time, especially from a female owner. But we all know Secretariat did it. So how do you build suspense with an outcome the audience already knows? Yeah, we know how it ends, but I knew right. that about Apollo 13 too. I still wanted all the adrenaline that went into the MacGyver and their terror of how they were going to pull this off. So um, it's a family story. You really do get a sense of the generations that it takes to make greatness, you know. You've always had an appreciation for horses. That's true. So is this almost a dream come true for you? Yes, in a word. <laughs> Thank you for recognizing that because I was eight years old when Secretariat did what he did. And uh, to me, it made total sense that horse, a horse, any horse, was on the cover of every magazine that there was. Penny, 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 Penny. what about all the attention Secretary is getting? Covers of both Time and Newsweek. The story may be familiar and have similarities to Seabiscuit, but the racing sequences set new screen standards. It challenged everyone to figure out a way to really get in there and be efficient and, and show it in a way that hasn't been seen before. And you're going to see, you know, horse racing action as it's never been seen. Kevin Connolly plays the author and real-life sports writer Bill Knack. So who's harder to work with, the cast of Entourage or Equines? They're like any other actor. They're like temperamental and, you know, work when they want to work and uh, <laughs> don't work when they don't want to work. Funny thing was um, when we were you know, obviously when the camera's off the horse and we re we're reacting to the races, there'd be like a little cardboard horse on a stick that was sort of going around that you would follow your eyes and be like, yeah, yeah. So uh, you, it's amazing too, you watch the film and it's like, God, wow, it looks like we're there and it feels like we're looking at horses, but you're really not. The film centers on Secretariat, but truly it's the family story and journey of Penny Chenery Tweedy as played by Diane Lane. Watching it, it seemed like you were made to make this part and that everything leading up to this sort of informed this. Did, did it feel like that at all? Penny was just my hero in so many ways because she wasn't wishy-washy or mealy-mouthed. And um, so I'm grateful that I was selected to bring her to the screen because, you know, I, I, I just found it very refreshing to play somebody who, as feminine as she was, it never took away from her power, and as powerful as she was, it never took away from her femininity, and that's rare.